This is a CA, a small town in Kwara State, Nigeria, and it is most famous for being home to the largest collections of stone carvings in Africa, and it houses the first ever established national museum in Nigeria, and it was established in the year 19. 19- 45 and we are here to set up a commercial plant and feud for one of our clients we just arrived Uru in Kwara state and we are going to be heading down to the field location for the project so it's going to be an amazing time i needed to stay good okay Peace. I am ready for the day and I am going to be setting out right about now for the first day of the project. So it's going to be an amazing time and I really want you to stay glued to this amazing project. There's a whole lot because I'm going to be literally showing you everything both the on field and the off field activities so we are going to be carrying out. It's going to be awesome. Okay, so let us head down to the field right about now. So we're heading to the field. It's now your 7 a.m. local time here. It's going to be an interesting day because today is going to be the day one of the field setup and we're literally going to be showing you everything, everything we are going to be doing at the food location so it's gonna be awesome okay so stay glued guys i have arrived the field heading straight out to the site location but we I'm gonna be executing the project. I'm gonna show you what the view looks like. This is what the view looks like over there, is where we are gonna be setting up this project. It's gonna be a 2,500 feet capacity here in Kwara State. That means is we are gonna be setting up one hectare of land here. It's gonna be a commercial field standard. You are gonna see how we go about with the field that absorbing first this to do a proper field survey right now i am just gonna do an area survey of this place to have an understanding of what it looks like from the area that will then guide us on how to quality map out and get the right field layout at the end of the day stay glued guys so let us fly guys now looking at the field from the top you can see it is a fairly plain field and it had just been recently cleared but those black spots you are seeing there are all heaps of debris and those black spots are going to pose a bit of obstruction to us as we progress but we are going to figure out how to get rid of them before the commencement of the marking operation on this field to ensure we had a smooth navigation during the mapping out operation the black spots you saw from the area view which are heaps of debris had to be burned so as to ensure that we are not having major obstructions during the marking out operation the marking out operation ensures that we have a very smooth or well outlined field and when those obstructions are there we are not really going to have the right plant population so we want to get them out and ensure that who's our dog even on those spots where we have those heap of debris and that is why we need to burn them and then ensure that they burn completely to the ground so that we have a very very smooth navigation operation during the mapping and the marking and the digging operation so don't get confused don't get it twisted we are getting into the reason why we are here in ACA Quara State which is to set up this commercial planting field for our client 
this next operation is the field layout operation and it is one of the most important operations during a field setup that is why i specifically tie out this particular operation so this is the mapping out of the field this operation would determine the yield you are going to be getting from the field at the end of the day this operation is what is used to determine the plant spacing for a commercial planting field we use a two meter by two meter plant spacing and at the end of the day we are expected to get nothing less than a thousand planting plant from one acre of land so after that is now the pegging pressure we begin to peg those points that we marked out to ensure that we have a well outlined field As you can see it is looking super aligned so after this operation we are then going to move down to the next operation which is now the digging out of the already marked out point so where are we supposed to dig out we are supposed to dig out the intersection point of the horizontal and the vertical line enjoy the digging out operation guys After the mapping and digging out operation, the next thing we need to carry out is the herbicide application. And this operation is very, very critical. I cannot overemphasize the importance of you applying your herbicide before you plant. Herbicide operation ensures that the weeds are dried up are suppressed and it allows the newly planted plantain suckers to begin to emerge and is able to compete for survival before the emergence of wheat and by then they would have been properly established or you then start another round of herbicide application when the weed again begin to emerge but now when you are applying your herbicide when your crops have already sprouted there's a very special technique you must pay attention to and there are certain herbicides you use you do not use the same herbicide you would use when the field is in this state as you can see right and when you already have your established crop okay so don't worry you come for a mentorship class for you to get all those juices all right so the weed you have available on your field then determines the kind of herbicide you get to use for this video we aren't going into details we have a special video where we talked about specifically types of herbicide and then the application of this herbicide on your field based on what you have on your field then determines what herbicide you are going to be applying so for this field we are going to be applying a systemic non-selective herbicide on this field because of the nature of the weed we have available okay so and that is the operation these guys are carrying out right now and after now we would begin the next operation which is the you application of soy amendment or application oh, of annual yeah. stay tuned guys this next operation is the manual application operation as you can see you have to ensure you are making use of a manual that is already decomposed or fully dried do not use manuals that have maggot present in them because you might only introduce pathogens to the field. The manual application operation has commenced and this is done in order to ensure that once the suckers begin to sprout they are going to meet a nutrient rich environment which would ensure that they thrive in their early stages of development
the five of the field setup and the whole lot you need to learn as regards setting up field commercially it's a totally different ball game from when you want to do that on a very small scale but then if you're a newbie because a couple of person have asked that how do we really go about a field setup and all of that a whole lot comes into play when you want to set up your field and you need to you just have to know this way beyond the beautiful landscape we get to show you beautifully outlined field you get to see at the end of the day is way way beyond all of that comes down to a whole lot of planning all that you see us execute on the field is just probably maybe 50 percent of the work before the field set up a whole lot of planning the arrangements have to go into place one of the things we ensure that we we'll make arrangement for is all the materials we have to use sometimes because of the locations might be working from choir or you know moving suckers from a farm location down to the project location like currently i'm in Quara, so we had to you know make arrangement for logistics to ensure that everything arrives at the perfect time okay it's not arriving too early and it's not arriving too late this is one of the things that we ensure that are put in place this is the arrival of the plantain suckers coming in from a farm location down to the project location we deal in elephant giant variety of hybrid suckers and these suckers are super super awesome yeah. so if you want to place your orders all you need to do is send a whatsapp dm on the number appearing on your screen we would supply to you anywhere in this country and as well as across the country so guys do not snooze This is the soccer treatment operation and it is very very important and critical for your commercial plantain field during the course of movement from the farm location down to the project location there's every possibility that these suckers may have come in contact with pathogens and you do not want to take risk as a farm owner this is a commercial farm and it's not a backyard farm it's not a garden where you just want to have meals it's a commercial farm you've invested a couple of millions into it you don't want to take chances and that is why the treatment of the suckers become very critical you do this before you begin your planting what you do basically is after mix mixing your treatment in your water you stir thoroughly and then you soak your suckers in this solution for about three to five minutes then you allow them to air dry before you then plant this operation will serve as both treatment or curative and preventive curative if the suckers in any way contracted pathogens on its way down to the field and preventive in order to ensure that even while you plant them on the field they are not going to be infested because by then they would have been well treated so that's the critical essence of why we treat these suckers guys after the treatment operation the suckers are allowed to air dry this operation now is the operation that has to be carried out before the planting operation and this involves the supply of these suckers into the already dog holes this ensures and allows for the planters to concentrate on only planting and this brings about efficiency during a planting operations and this operation you know also brings about division of labor you have those who supply into the dog holes and then you have those who are responsible for the planting so it ensures the planters do the planting properly and are concentrated on planting the planting operation is very very critical because you want to ensure that your 
planters are concentrated and they are not heaping too much soil on the suckers because if they do it will give the suckers a longer time to sprout out because the method we use is the total berry method because what we supply are not suckers with pseudo stems we supply suckers with just the plantain comes okay so this allows us to transport or move large quantity of suckers from a farm location down to project locations but when they come with pseudo stems it's only going to occupy the space and the most important part of the sucker is not the stem but rather the comb the comb is where the regenerative part of the plantain is and that is where new life will begin from so that is what we supply all right guys peace So for your future setup or you want to purchase your suckers, all you need to do real quick is to send us a WhatsApp DM on that number appearing on your screen right about now. Or you send an email, go to the description of this video, you'll find our email details. Send us an email or you send us a WhatsApp message stating specific services that you want. If you want soccer supplied to you across the country or you want us to come in and set up your field professionally that your commercial field that your 20 acres that your 50 acres even that your two acres if you want it to be set up professionally you want to get the right plant population you want your field to be well outlined you want it done in the best way possible you want to have the right plant population the benefits are unending they are so unlimited or you want us to come in evaluate that your existing field or that your farm all you need to do real quick is send us a message and we will be more than happy to get you established the best way and if you're still watching this video till now you haven't still subscribed to our channel just yet all you need to do real quick before the next please second is to punch on that subscribe button turn on your notification and do what you like this video we have come to the end of the planting operation but if i were you i wouldn't be in a haste to go because there's still a whole lot of behind the scene activities coming your way right about now welcome to behind the scene this is one of our team members we refer to him as small because physically he is not that you know huge is a teenager and luckily for us they were currently on vacation from school he is actually done with secondary school so writing his sni exams trying to get admission into the higher institution so we're fortunate to have them around a couple of them who really work with us through this time so these guys are so so funny Wait, call of file, a bin you a below file, small. Can I let small? What you need? Samsung, but it's okay. Enjoy that. Samsung, but come on, she will enjoy you. Eh, you shall judge if you judge and judge you. Oh, more. I give you leave. I I I I now you do this one. <laughs> oh boy. And according to our custom, we usually try to ensure that we do a scent forth cooking. This is to ensure that everyone is happy, the plants are happy, the guys are happy, which is very, very critical to ensuring that we have a very successful food setup 
journey. The land doesn't depend on the you know happiness of the guys who plant it to germinate or to grow or to do well. It all depends on the management. But here, guys, we need you to enjoy the rest of this video, enjoy the cooking activities, and a lot of fun activities that happen behind the scene. Peace, guys. Hello. I'm a party to very lossy party. For that, my wife snap. Oya <laughs> 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 guys it was indeed an amazing time here in Quara state and we just rounded off with this massive project it took us six days to achieve all of what we achieved here and i tell you it was quite amazing it was quite interesting and you know what for those of you who want to set up similar project all you need to do right about now is go to the description of this video or you are going to see the number appearing right now on your screen send us a whatsapp message or go to the description send us an email and you know indicate tell us how many hectares of land you want to set up commercially and we will be more than happy to get you started on the right note guys see you in our next project and and just before we go if you haven't subscribed to our channel just yet all you need to do right about now is punch on the subscribe button turn on your notification bell and do well to like this video we will see you in our next video peace